Hi, this is Joseph with American Trade Masters again, and I'm going to show you a couple of tricks of the trade. And uh, it's on taking out a, a door jam. So, uh, just first the tools you need. Here's my little helper right here. Um, so, I like to use a flat um, pry bar because if I'm trying to take the trim off and not damage it, it works really good. This, in this case, we don't really care, but I'm going to show you that anyway. And a uh, nice little sawzall. Make sure you get a nice blade that will cut all the way through the jam. Um, and then just a hammer. And that's, that's basically it. Um, before, you, uh, before you take it off, what, what you got to do is it's usually caulked in. So uh, I've already scored it all the way around, but you'll want to take and, and score it really good with a razor knife all the way around the edges on this side, and then also on this side here. Um, I, I think that uh, the, uh, the, um, the idea of doing it is, is just, to, to, just to loosen that caulking up a little bit so that it doesn't tear the drywall out. So um, the other thing um, I like to do is, is I'll come through and I'll just start loosening the trim. front and then down the side so uh, pop it up like that and then you can take your flat bar if you have a flat bar you can also go this way like I said it works really good uh, with leverage because you don't have to worry about it breaking the trim so once you get that all off on each side there's one piece down and then we'll go to this piece. See, it comes off really good once you once you uh, score all that off. So that piece is out. One more up here at the top, and it just pops right off. Oops, see, it broke. This is a composite. It's just. Medium density. Kind of cheap, but this door was uh, the same door for the front building. So. And then once you got that off, then you have these nails all the way around the side. Get those in right, right away. But you're going to run the saws. So usually, um, you can see how this door is shimmed. It's, uh, it's got shims, uh, one on the top, one in the center, and one down here below by the shims. Um, that's typical. And in another video, I'll show you how I, uh, I install the door. But they usually just shoot them in this way. So I take my saws all and I'll work with gravity. And then I'll just go down to cut all the nails. cut through nails. You can see at my shim points is where they'll they'll put the nails also hold the shims in place. There's one up here too. There's that one. And then same with this side.
and sometimes they put them up here too, so just go ahead and do a quick run. Take a little block and a, and a hammer. Start pounding it out the other way. Actually, I still got the trim on this other side, so I have to loosen it up really quick. that side. Score down the edge. And that. I got, had to get behind a little corner back here. We got that going. It's pretty, pretty mean stuff. Okay, so there's that. And then we just continue sneaking it out of there. I like to use leverage going from the bottom. It's catching a little bit of. So this carpet's holding it in. If I start there, lever at the top, and then we're out. And there you have a torn out jam. Stay tuned and we'll be installing the door. Thanks for watching.